YouTube Retro Chef here. It's just gone four o'clock Sunday afternoon. Uh, this is my car boot pickups. Uh, there's no pickup wild video this week because uh, I never got a chance to go out during the week. So went car boot today, picked up a few bits, a um, couple of good bits, not a lot. Uh, I was messaging to this morning uh, about our five quarter six and saying to him, I don't think I'm going to find much today, sort of thing, because. He knows, you know, we both know it's getting near the, near the end of the car booting year, should we say. My neighbour's dogs are going crazy. Um, yeah, and I, I miss his Sega Saturn lad, Scott. I don't know if I woke him, so just Scott, if I did, mate, I'm really sorry. When I'm, when I'm up early, I'll just, I'll just presume everyone else is up. But yeah, just, I just actually got off the phone to uh, Dad's Corners of Laura, so Dad's up, be good, bruv. Uh, my brother from another mother. Looking forward to seeing you at play. Uh, just spoke about a few bits, and obviously you spoke about Jay, um, Cyber Snake Jay losing his father. So my thoughts are out to you and your family, mate. Um, I don't know what you're going through, but if anything you need, you know, if you want to chat to a stupid North London uh, person, you can ring me. Um, but yeah, hope, hope, uh, you know, what, what, what do you, yeah, just sorry if you lost, mate. Basically. Um, <clears throat> I haven't spoke to many other people this week. I've been trying to sort, uh, get hold of uh, Carl Ocarina the fella, so I hope you're good, mate. I, I think we'll be mess messaging this afternoon about a few bits, hoping you come to play. Uh, I know Rob t uh, Rob Tino Triple Seven's not coming, which is a shame because um, I'm, I'm, I'm happy because he's not going to uh, crush the back wheels of my car, the suspension. Because <laughs> he's massive, man. I swear to you, he should have been a wrestler. Sure, you make make some money. Maybe we could uh, we could do do that as a side gig, Rob. Maybe I can be like a manager or something. Uh, but no, I'm I'm bit you know you're not coming, so that's not good at all, really. Um, but never mind. You know you just say you're gonna come Blackpool, so that'd be good. Bit of Mega Man, but I don't know if he's gonna play anything else. Yeah. Um, yeah, I've just been say I've been busy work this week. But I'm more busy and now getting signed to pick up. So for me, starting to dwindle down, trying to get to carbo, but I did get there today. I didn't get loads, but what I did get was some good bits. But the first thing I want to do is show a trade I've done with a very good YouTuber. Um, I would put him down there, but I still, I still ain't worked it out. So I'm not, I'm not going to, but anyway, it's Welsh Steve, Steve326, Steve326, wait there. Um, you know what, I'm rubbish with numbers. You should, you'd think I've been good being a chef, I should be good with numbers. So his real name is Steve. <laughs> his username is Steve36207. Uh, Welsh Steve to me, to most other people. He was after... No, he spoke to me about Psycho Fox one time. And I said to him, yeah, I know someone who's got one of them. Uh, unlucky enough, the person I knew had it sold it. But I managed to pick him up one last week at the car boot, which uh, I sent out to him yesterday on Saturday. So you should get it Monday, uh, probably Tuesday now in the bloody post. Um, so yeah, we, we did a trade. Um, for something I've already got, but I actually need the manual. So I thought, you know what? Some, some, someone next door is going crazy. Um, yeah, so I need the manual for this game. But to be fair, the um, I'm having a little, a little dance there. <laughs> the box itself is better condition than mine, and actually the, the cartridge is better condition than mine. So I'm probably just going to swap this out for mine. And the game is. I need to find out. Do you actually did you actually pay this for it, Steve, or did you get it from somewhere else? Because it's a great price, but if you paid this, well, I'm sure you must have swapped out for yours. But anyway, anyway, anyway. <laughs> the game is Fire Shark, which is an awesome game if you've never played it. And he got it from Next Level Games, which he mentioned to me. And I've added them now on Facebook. He got it, He must have paid, or they must have had it for 9.99. Uh, if you haven't played this game before, it's just like 1942 or uh, Super Lest or Ikaruga, You know, 
old, oldie woldy planes, US squadron. So yeah, Steve, thank you very much, mate. You're a legend. You should get yours. I would have said Tuesday probably. I doubt Monday. No, in the post. So that's my one and only trade for this week. And everything else is car boot. <clears throat> so I went to one car boot today. Um, went to the one in Dunton's again, where I met uh, Scott. I messaged him, but say he was um, he wasn't coming out to play today. He wasn't allowed to come out to play, or whatever you want to say. He wasn't wasn't coming out to play. Um, busy, busy, um, but not not a lot of games already. I walked it. I managed to walk it twice in about two hours, uh, an hour and a half, and like there was no games. Um, there was a couple of bits that was quite interesting. A, a man was selling a Neo Geo CD. Um, no games, two controllers, two big controllers, uh, and he wanted 150 for it. Now I haven't actually got one, but <sighs> spending 150 at a car boot, I think Tootie, I think, I think even you would roll over. Um, I was a bit like, I said, look, mate, I said uh, I'm interested, but I'm not looking to pay 150. I'm bidding on something on eBay, so I might, hopefully, I might win it. Um, so yeah, I said to him, you know, would you take 80? And he was like, no, 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 I want 150. I said, well, I can't even check if it works. I said, and you know, he goes, oh, no, I'll give you my number and all that. I was just a bit like, I thought, you know what, I'm not too fussed. Neo Geo CD is not something I've actually wanted to get. Uh, saying that, I probably when I go and check it on eBay or go and check it on YouTube, where it's like the games, and if I probably, I probably end up wanting one. Um, but I'm pretty strict. I want an AES or an MVS like conversion. So yeah, he had that and he had a Retron 3, but he wanted 40 quid for that, so I was, but I've got all the consoles anyway, so I wasn't too fussed. He had nothing else worth any good. Um, I'm trying to think what, what's the best way to do it. So yeah, I'll do, I was walking around and there was like, um, I think most car you always get these geezers with big tubs of stuff full of shit, basically. And one of them was full of games, PS2, PS1. N64, GameCube, but they're all rubbish. But I found this at the bottom, and I've never heard of it. And since now that I've looked up, looked it up, it's, it goes for about a tenner on eBay. So I thought, oh, yeah, I'm happy with that. It's called Return of the Ninja. It's by Natsuma. It's on the Game Boy Color. Never seen it before, but for a pound, I will take that. I've played it. It plays just like Ninja Gaiden, Ninja Gaiden, if you want to say. But for a pound, I thought I'd have that. So that'd be days. Um, there was a youngish kid, probably about 16, selling a load of PS2 games, so I thought, you know what, I have a little look. Went through them all, pulled out the best four really that were there, um, mainly because one, they're either better CDs than mine, or the better cases or better manuals, whatever you want to say. Um, the first one, <clears throat> which I love this game, I need to get a few more of these on the old PS3. Uh, this is say way better condition than mine, and some say it is Shemu free or the we're on the same genre on the same way wavelength should we say it's uh, Yakuza. It's all complete, so I was happy about that. It's, it's way better condition than mine, so I was happy with that. Second one is Red Dead Revolver because again this is better condition than mine. It's like mint, so I was happy with that. I don't think this is going to play, is it? Well, you've got that. Uh, next one, I pulled this one mainly because, to be honest, I've got so many of these, I don't know which one's which, so I picked it up. It's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Melee. It's not complete, but I need to check whether or not I've got it, but that's not a problem. Next one, I've got, but the actual disc is in way better condition than mine. I know that for a fact, because mine was the original one when I got it. Batman Vengeance. I've got all of those, those four, for basically two quid. So two pounds, happy with that. <clears throat> it's going to be a quick one today, really, because I didn't pick up a lot. Um, there was an old lady selling loads and loads of books and magazines and that, and I, was, I just saw, I just saw basically, what did I see? I saw this bit, I saw just, if you can see that. It says Prima. I just sort of, well, I'm going to turn it this way, man. 
I just saw the Prima sign, if you can just see that, the P. So I knew straight away it was going to be a games manual, or games, um, well, guide. And it was Super Mario Galaxy 2. And I got this for 50p. It's absolutely massive. It's got a poster in there, and you know, it's the whole, it's the, it's the guide for the game, basically. So I thought for 50p, happy days. <clears throat> Next one, there was, I don't know how old he was, probably about my age, 30, 31, 32, he had a load of PS1, PS2 games on his table, uh, I had all of them and they were not any good to, even to buy to trade with you guys, there was nothing there any good. There was this box on the table, and basically, I just opened it up and I saw inside that there was a DS. So when I opened it, there was a DS, a really nice black one, really nice condition, missing the stylist, but I'm not too worried, I've got enough styluses around, uh, so that's because that charges, and there was a few games in the bomb, I said, how much is that fella? He went, oh, five pound. I said, what, five pound for the, everything? He went, yeah, five pound. So I, I, saw, I saw a load of games in the bomb, I didn't see what games there was, I mean, I'll go through them now. There's nothing, there's nothing to stand at, but for five pound, bloody hell, do you know what I mean? So there's, there's four Game Boy Advance games. One's called Star X. I think about that one. Spyro, Season of the Ice. Uh, Hot Potato. <clears throat> Max Payne. And then the DS games. Yeah, I won something. Perfect. So there's four Game Boy Advance and there is nine DS games. Uh, just cartridge only, which is a shame, but never mind. First one is the Avatar Legend of Aang, the Burning Earth. So, yep, I haven't got that one. Uh, Star Wars Force Unleash. Uh, I've got Meet the Robinsons. Uh, Spore. Creatures, small creatures, yeah. Uh, Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End. Uh, Aragon, Aragon, maybe you want to say. <clears throat> I've got Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest, the Dog Fighter Edition, as two he says. It's absolutely been beat, eaten alive by a dog or something. Um, the best two, really, I would have said, or maybe I'm wrong. I haven't played all them. I've got Ben 10 Protector of Earth and Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of the Darkness. <clears throat> so, yeah, last thing, last three games. I thought I might have showed you a bit of the gameplay. Big cup of tea, not in my Retro Chef mug because uh, I thought I'd make this quick. Second time around, um, going past this tables, uh, two ladies, I think they were sisters, in their forties, maybe fifties. I went past the first time. I remembered them because they had a, a Nissan Qashqai, the same car as my wife. So when I, every time I see one, I think I was at my wife, even though I know it's not her. She's at home sleeping. I always do that. I'm sure everyone's the same. So I saw the car and I thought, oh, it's my missus' car. I was like, oh, well, it's the same, mate. So. I remember second time round, I went past the car and there was a box of games on the floor. So whoosh, went over to it. Uh, box of DS games. Uh, must, must have been about 50 P uh, DS games. Easy, 50 DS games. Um, so, going from loads of. They said they were her games. She goes, I oh, know my games. So I was like, alright. Because there was like um, my cooking coach, my smoking coach, my. Uh, 100 book galleries, loads of games. Um, but uh, the best three here, really. Um, there was nothing else at all worth taking out of, that, out of that little bunch. So I said, How much are the games? She had a pound. So I was looking for them, looking for them, because there was, was about 50, there was quite a few in the big tub. And as I got to the bottom, I found these three, so I grabbed them out. I said, Oh, would you just do um, 
three for two quid. She's like, oh, okay, fair enough. So yeah, I was like, happy days. So two for three quid. Um, never played this on the DS. Uh, I quite like the DS, I must admit. So I'm hoping this would be quite good. Uh, it is Tomb Raider Underworld. It's boxing complete, so it's all in there. Just, I was just checking myself. It's all in there. She must have bought it second hand, but anyway. It's the first one. Second one, I probably, I've probably picked this up so many times now. So this is up for trade or sale, whatever. Uh, it's another copy of New Super Mario Brothers. It's all complete in there. <clears throat> so I haven't, I haven't actually played it or nothing, but see if there's a save and how far they are. I can't do that. But yeah, so Super Mario Brothers, uh, New Super Mario Brothers, and the pick of the day and the pick of the bunch. Uh, I've already got it, so it's up for swap or sale or whatever. Pokemon Diamond version. Only problem is there's no manual. It's got the Nintendo Wi-Fi connection and the health and safety thingy in it, but no manual. <coughs> so yeah, that's it for me. That's me today. Very small. What's that? Like 10 minutes, 13 minutes, something like that. <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, so that's it really. Just want to clear up a couple of things. Uh, to eat, I haven't sent your game out to you yet, uh, even though we haven't even sort out a trade run, I think, for it. I'm going to bring it with me to uh, play Manchester because I think it'll be a nice icebreaker. Because, um, you know, I think it'll be a nice icebreaker. So I've got that here, I've still got it here. I'm not going to show what it is actually. I'm not going to show what it is. Because um, you can do that. So I've got that one. Um, play, yep. Yeah. So I'm coming to play. I'm well looking forward to it. Uh, I'm bringing my big brother, my big brother Paul, uh, who I'm sure is watching. So who? Um, he's coming up with me. I'm going to drive up there Saturday morning, come back Saturday night. Uh, I'm only doing it for one day. I'm, I'm not staying two days. I'm, you know, I was saying, I was saying, Daz, I'll, you know, I'll bring a lot of money with me, but I don't even know what I want to buy. Um, I haven't got a Scooby what I want to buy. Uh, even if I just come and just see you lot, I'm happy because to be fair, that's you know, that's, that's why we do all this. I collect, I collect, you know, I collect all my games, and that's for me. But the other side of it, why I do this side of it, is to meet and greet all you lot. You know, I love meeting up with Carl and Daz and Tina Triple Seven and Gasset. Gasset, that'd be good, brother. Um, at Play Nation, you know, and I'm, I've met you there before, and talking to you on the phone, and you know, talking to Reaper Man 360, to um, the Highlander who we was, we was we messaged the other day. It's quite funny. I, I just presumed he was American. I'm, sorry, I'm sure he's American because his accent. But he was messaging me the other day. He was messaging. Yeah, he goes, "Oh, he's an hour in front of me," and I'm thinking, "When the hell is America in front of me?" Then I realise he's in Holland. So. My apologies, uh, <laughs> I'm not all there. So yeah, you know, <clears throat> I'm looking forward to meeting Shock 16, um, Ben Shimuza, I'm, I'm, oh, I was looking forward to meeting you as well. I don't know who else is going, so if you're, all, if anyone's going, please put a link, at the, put a little message up on me who you want to meet up with. Still want to meet up with Retro Dave and Cyber Snake J, hopefully, God willing. Um, and Daz, obviously, I want to give Daz a big hug. I haven't seen him since. God, uh, last year now. Would it been last year? Yeah, it would have been last, last, last Christmas. No, I oh, whenever it was anyway. I fucking <laughs> I haven't seen him in such a long time. Rich King Metro, I'm looking forward to meeting you, fella, because we've been messaging a little bit on the old uh, YouTube. Um, I don't know who else is going. I haven't really seen who else is going. Richard Turner, you ain't going, which is a shame. Cause I'd like to meet you. <clears throat> but Tui, I'm looking forward to meeting Tui, because um, we're, we're not, well, not similar, because obviously I'm more attractive, but we're both die-hard carboos, we get up at the crack house at dawn, you know, we travel for gum trees, go to charity shops, so we're, we're you know, pretty much the same, I'm like the Bruce Wayne, he's like the, uh, the Dick Grayson, you know. But um, yes, so I hope everyone's good. I'm gonna go now. It is, I think I've been about 20 minutes, I don't even know. But I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna go and terrorize my kids for the rest of the afternoon because uh, I was looking after them while my missus was out. 
and I'm not going to play this today. Um, I'm going to play probably the PS4 inside. So yes, I'm chatting rubbish. I'm doing a daz. Just looking around because there's something moving up there. Oh, it's all right. It's just a bit of wind. So uh, <laughs> thanks for watching. Please comment, subscribe, thumbs it up if you wish. If you don't, never mind. And the next vid will probably be... Hmm, it might be a play because I'm not sure if I'm going to go Kaibu next week purely because I don't want to spend any more money. But we'll see. <clears throat> so guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you all again soon. Bye-bye.